But I'm on my iPod 24-7. to film what's on my iPod 5 video for you all today I watch these videos I've loved these videos and so I was like why not film one training and I'm kind of sick so don't mind my voice um I have my iPod 5 fifth generation here um it is silver 64 gigs um I bought it with my own money if you were wondering it's actually the second iPod I got because I got a blue one and then all of a sudden it stopped working so I went out and bought a new one, came back and it started working good. So I just gave it to my mom and so I have my new one, you know, yeah. And um, I have this case on it, um, I'll just show you the case, I got it off of Amazon, it's by the brand U Lock, designed in Germany, made in China. So. Um, this is what the case looks like. Um, it's stitching and then this cl magnetic clip. And when you open it up, it looks like this. There's a little spot for your money. And there was a little um, clip right here to put around your wrist. But I don't use that, so I took it off. Um, then I have my two flaps. Two little flaps. What are you? I don't know what they're called. Cards in there. And then on the back is just a hole for your front camera. I'm gonna stop that get into what's on it okay so by the way I do have a screwing protector on it so that's what these little bubbles are for and this literally the screen protector has saved my life as you can see I've dropped it several times and it's made little marks on the screen protector so yeah that's if you're wondering that's what those little bubbles are from Spoil galaxy pattern I love galaxy patterns and I just decided to do like a purple one because it kind of went with my case. Like having plain backgrounds that aren't like pictures because then um, you can't really see the picture but with plain backgrounds it's just, I think it looks nicer just in my opinion. Okay so when you open up my iPad this is just what it looks like. I have three pages. First page um, I just have messages down here. Um, pretty self-explanatory. These are just the apps it comes with. So messages, mail, safari, music, it all comes with that. And then I have Instagram, which pretty sure most of you guys should know about. Just Instagram where you upload pictures. And um, then I have Snapchat, which is just where you send pictures to your friends. Then of course I have YouTube and I also have free my apps. You download these and try them out for 30 seconds. And then, so see all these are worth credit all these apps you can do and then when you get enough credits you can get a ton of gift cards like iTunes gift cards Amazon Google Play they have a ton of gift cards you can get um, the next app I have is camera photos Netflix yeah um then I also have blogger so this is my blog um, it's I'm a makeup maniac um, there's actually a link to it on my YouTube and yeah I just made a post a couple days ago and yeah I've just started my vlog I've had two posts so far and um, yeah you should check that out then on my second page I have Amazon instant video then I also have lifetime and if you don't know what lifetime is it is an app where you can watch shows for free um, Lifetime is just a name. It's pretty much, you know, like Fox and ABC, except it's for Lifetime. Um, and they have Dance Moms on there, so that's pretty much why I have it. Then I have Pinterest. And then I also have Pump Up, which lots of YouTubers do um, have this app. 
to start workout, go to workout. Then you can choose what you want to do. Let's oh, let's say I wanted just to be healthy. I could choose beginner, the duration of my time. I can choose. Let's say I'm going to gym. You can choose what they have there, and what you want to work out. Let's say full. Let's say I want to work out all of them. You can do conditioning and core circuit. And yeah, you just enter those things, and that's pretty much it. And then they'll keep you on track with breaks, and they'll tell you what to do for how long. It's really fun. Then I also have Twitter, We Heart It, Tumblr, and Kick, which are just some more social media stuff that I go on a lot. Because these two pages are the stuff I go on the most. And I don't know, I like this layout where I only have two rows of stuff. I just like it like that. I think it looks nicer, in my opinion, so that's why I have that. The last page um, are all my folders. And so for set photography, I have Be Funky, Cropic, Ivory, I'm not even sure how you say that, um, Rachika, Fanto, PixArt, Pic Collage, and Afterlight, and I don't even know if I said any of those right, but okay. Um, Be Funky just is, has a filter app in Collage Maker that I use, then Cropic is how I get my white borders on Instagram, Ivory, I mostly use that to, um, to focus stuff so like you can make everything else blurry but like one part um then Martika has a bunch of filters Fanto I do for text PixArts I love their filters Pic Collage do collages and Afterlight has a ton of filters and like cropping and a bunch of random stuff that I use then in games I just have Trivia Crack Crossy Road Smash Hit Piano Tiles Heyday Unblock Me Heads Up Cooking Fever and Let It Go and these are just the apps um, the games I play the most. I don't really play a lot of games, but if I'm like traveling or something and I want to play a game, these are just the games I'll play. And yeah. Then in social, I just have other social media like Google Plus, Messenger, Facebook, Google, Vine, Uvu, Followers Plus to keep up on when I'm posting and how many followers I have on Instagram. Uvu, I don't really use a lot. And then Vine. Um, I mostly just watch vines. I don't really make them. And then Google and Google Plus are associated with my YouTube. And then I just have Facebook and Facebook Messenger. Then other are just all the things that it comes with except for better fonts. Um, which I just use for fonts. And this is the stuff I don't really use a lot. They're kind of like utilities but I just named it others. Because down here I have a utilities folder which is the stuff I use the most. I use notes, voice memo, settings, calculator weather, and Dropbox. If you don't know what Dropbox is, it's like an uh, online photo storage thing. I have Spotify, which is kind of like Pandora, except people make playlists and you listen to those and it shuffle and it's free. You can shuffle them and they're free. And then I have Music Downloader, which you can just download music for free. Bam, which is a really nice app. I love it so much. Um, let's say I'm listen to the radio and I want to figure out what a song is you like click Shazam and you listen to it and then it will tell you what song it is it's really amazing I absolutely love it um then for school I just have campus portal which has infinite campus translate for Spanish if I don't know a word I'll look it up on Google translate then I have Quizlet which is really amazing you can just make flashcards and stuff then I have Google Drive and Gmail then for video, I have a bunch of video editing apps. I used to have a Kik account, but I deleted it because I didn't go on it anymore. And these were like the apps I used to make stuff. I just have Video Hands, Gravy, Video Shop, Font, Square Ready, um, Video Star, and um, most of these are paid for apps. You have to buy all of them except for Vaunt, Square Ready, and Video Star. And yeah, I use iMovie for when I do my vlogs because I take my vlogs on here. So this is all I have on my iPod 5. I hope you guys like that video. Make sure to like, comment, request, and subscribe. We'll be having a 100 subscriber giveaway, which I'm so excited for. For I can't believe I'm almost at 100 subscribers. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.